Andrew Benedict recognized early in his career that overuse and contamination seriously threaten the world's water resources. While others focused on activated carbon, Andrew recognized the potential of membrane technology to improve wastewater treatment. Determined to make a difference, he took a risk and formed Xenon Environmental to design and implement water filtration systems. He grew Xenon from a startup enterprise into a major international company. His system spurred innovation in the industry and brought clean water to communities around the world. People talk about 2.6 billion people lacking appropriate sanitation. That's lacking a toilet. That material for three quarters of the population of the planet isn't treated in any fashion. So we need the kinds of transformations that Andrew has helped to, to bring into regular use, to recycle water uh, for, uh, for human consumption. Back uh, about 10 years ago, uh, there were no membrane technologies that were really commercially available at a reasonable cost for wastewater treatment. Waste treatment facilities essentially did very little. There were problems with materials like soaps. I can remember seeing women looking at their Monday morning wash where the soap suds from the waste treatment plant came in billows six to eight feet across. Nobody paid any attention to waste treatment. In 2025, about half of the population of this planet is going to lack access to uh, appropriate water supplies. Andrew's achievement was really marrying two uh, established technologies, that is membranes, which are a highly efficient uh, mechanism for separating and retaining particles from water, along with biological systems, especially the activated sludge process, marrying those two processes together. What Andrew saw was the opportunity to, to commercialize it, you know, benefit mankind in terms of providing both environmental protection, but especially water supply for, uh, for what's becoming a very water short planet. Andrew's system is unique in that it utilizes individual strands of membranes. These are actually hollow fibers so that only the clean water is pulled into the center of the fiber and drawn out. We've calculated that there's 152 million of these fibers in the Brightwater treatment plant. Basically, we're farming microorganisms that are doing the work of metabolizing pollutants uh, and cleaning the water so that we can pipe this through our, our Brightwater system to golf courses, play fields, and other users. And it allows us to help conserve uh, precious drinking water supplies. Andrew's technology uh, allows us to do this critical step of recycling water much less expensively. It's also a much more reliable process and of course when we're talking about taking a, you know, taking a water that's been used, we absolutely need a high degree of reliability of those processes to, you know, to protect public health. This technology is a, a significant advancement in the wastewater treatment industry and it gives wastewater treatment plants an opportunity to utilize a new technology to achieve much higher quality water. To take this idea and to turn it into a, into a reality it takes creativity, it takes smart people, it takes committed people, but it takes stubborn people that see that this is, this is something that needs to be done and they just refuse to quit. And that's what Andrew brings to this. He is all of those things. He sees that doing good can also be good for you. And that is something that the world needs more of. I'm very pleased to see that this award has been given to you. You're the ideal person for that award. You are unassuming. You have done always your level best in all that you do. Congratulations, Andrew, on the award. We are looking forward to having you here at Brightwater once we are operational. Andrew, I just want to congratulate you for, most importantly, for the uh, things that you've done over the years. The recognition by your alma mater uh, through this Diamond Award is uh, 
one of many that you've received recently, but it really reflects a, a long history of con contributing to a society and contributing to the profession. We honor Andrew Benedict with the 2011 Entrepreneurial Excellence Diamond Award.